How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. So does Proton VPN work with Netflix? Let's go ahead and test it. So um, I was just testing 30 Rock earlier, but let's go ahead and test Sync 2 this time around. So Sync 2 is only available in the United States and South Korea. And if I try to look it up without a VPN here, it just doesn't show up. Let's go ahead and connect to the state server right here, or it'll just pick a server. Uh, depending on which is the best. There are lots of uh, free servers here. Not a lot, but most of them are congested and we've got quite a few, probably about 25, 30 servers. And let's go ahead and refresh. Now, the cool thing about Proton VPN is it has unlimited bandwidth, unlike most uh, free VPNs. So let's see what happens here. Sync 2 is available, but um, I think it's not available in all uh, states. So maybe if uh, these servers are available in, um, or these servers are located rather in New York, maybe we won't be able to get access to it. Um, but either way, the streaming supporting uh, servers are locked behind a paywall. So as you can tell here, uh, the United States servers available here, the free servers, some of them support port forwarding, some of them support Onion over uh, VPN, and same with the Netherlands, but not for Japan. But there are no streaming uh, supporting servers right here. But if we go down, you'll notice that the paid servers do support streaming and peer-to-peer. -peer. So they're locked behind a paywall. And if you're looking for reliable access, I wouldn't exactly recommend paying for um, Proton VPN, I would recommend paying for a reliable premium VPN because if you get NordVPN or Surfshark, you'd be paying less uh, than what you would be paying for Proton VPN instead and get a better service. Um, and ExpressVPN is just the most premium out of all of them. Uh, so let's go ahead and refresh now that I'm connected to the ExpressVPN server. And as you can tell here, I have access to uh, Sync 2. But for some reason, it seems like we are still not able to get access to the other stuff here, the blank thumbnails. And it seems like it's not available in Washington still, maybe. So this is the cool thing about having access to many locations. You can just try out a different location. And keep in mind that Netflix is constantly blocking VPN IP addresses. So sometimes even Express Nord or Surfshark will um, have just a server or two that are not working. So now that I'm connected to New Jersey, this is active. This is live troubleshooting. If one server doesn't work, the next will work just fine. It's as simple as that. So now, as you can tell, we no longer have any blank um, thumbnails and we have access to uh, Sync 2 and I'm able to finally find that play button. It's as simple as that. So if you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find links to pricing discounts in the description down below as well as full reviews if you'd like to learn more about them with regards to the privacy policy, speed streaming, and torrenting capabilities, as well as security and features. Besides that, comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything VPNs and cybersecurity. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.